So today we have to talk about Shaquille O'Neal and his impact on the music industry, something that I don't think many of you are actually aware of, just how talented Shaquille O'Neal actually is. Now, stay till the end of the video because we're actually going to listen to one of Shaq's newest songs that he just released showing us that he hasn't lost it and he still got it. Make sure you like and subscribe, by the way. I appreciate it. So first of all, we all know that Shaquille O'Neal is like the king of side quests. This guy has been doing all types of stuff from business uh, to owning Papa John's now. I think he even owns a Forever 21 or maybe all of them. Uh, I don't know, from like uh, Icy Hot to The General to, oh my God, like the guy's done so many things. But one of the first ventures that he ever took on after he became a professional basketball player was actually a rapper. So today we're going to look at his career as a rapper, what he did, and why it's so important that we talk about the impact that he had on music. So first of all, can we just take a look at this picture right here of Shaquille O'Neal in his prime in the 90s, looking like a straight up professional rapper? I, I got to admit, I don't know who his agent was. I don't know who was managing him at the time, but this photo looks excellent. Like I look at him in that photo and I don't see a professional basketball player. I see a straight up rapper hip-hop artist who's doing his thing, okay? So let's talk about his discography. So so his four studio albums actually came out way back in the 90s, and believe it or not, uh, the album peaked at number 25 on the Billboard 200 for the number 10 spot on hip-hop albums. Shaquille O'Neal, professional basketball player, former Laker, okay, former champion, this guy had a platinum album on his resume, okay? But that's not all actually. So he actually ended up doing another album that also got a lot of praise and a lot of sales. <clears throat> and it was actually number 22 on the billboard, okay? And this actually ended up being certified gold. Gold, do you understand me? Gold, okay? Shaquille O'Neal has been making hip hop like for years and he has been doing such a great job that his numbers actually outshine some rappers of today. No, seriously. There are some rappers that you know that have nowhere near the amount of numbers and sales that Shaquille O'Neal had at the time that he was releasing music. So the titles of his albums were Shaq Diesel, that's the one that got platinum. Shaq Fu, The Return, that one got gold. You Can't Stop the Rain and Respect. These are the albums that he did and from the time of 1993 to 1998, that's when those albums were released. Now his compilation albums, which was the best of Shaquille O'Neal. Now keep in mind, usually you don't build a best of album until you become like a super famous hip hop or rock artist where you have hundreds if not thousands of songs that people know and love. This guy made a best of album for his own music and it did actually pretty well back in 1996. Yes, we cannot forget that Shaquille O'Neal actually made music for movies. If not any movie, of course, it would be the one that he starred in called Kazam. And that one was released in 1996. And I just want y'all to realize that, yes, the 90s was the time that Shaquille O'Neal was doing his thing with hip hop. This guy was destroying it. He was the best artist in the NBA, hands down, okay? So now let's go through some of the singles that Shaq has released. And we're going to talk about some of the accolades they received, okay? You got What's Up, Doc? Can We Rock? Okay, that song came out in 1993. That was certified gold, okay? I Know I Got Skills, 1993, certified gold. Um, he has songs like I'm Outstanding, Shoot Past Slam, Biological Didn't Bother. It goes on and on. And a lot of these reached the charts, Okay. I mean, number 39, number 35, number 47, number 78, number 103, number 82. I want you guys to realize something. There are many artists who never have their song on any hip-hop billboard album of... I want you all to think about this. There are so many artists of today who have not had one song reach the billboard, okay? They're trying, they scratch for the top, they never get there. Some artists that you know and love have never received a platinum record. They never received a gold record. But Shaquille O'Neal, Shaq Diesel, has done it several times. It's, in, it's incredible. I don't know why no one talks about this. This is amazing. So here's an actual article clipping from a website called Stereo Gum where people are actually excited, excited for the return of Shaquille O'Neal. It, it's, it's incredible the amount of people who almost have been sitting by waiting for him to make something else because they know just how great he is. 
Now, let's be very clear. Shaquille O'Neal is not the only NBA rapper. The difference is that Shaquille O'Neal is the most successful NBA rapper of all time. He's done it well, hands down, getting all types of accolades and getting his music promoted and shared, and it, he's still doing it to this day. But I think the most important part of this video is what I'm about to share with you now. You and I, we all are about to watch his most recent video, his most recent song that he has released, and uh, we, we gotta watch it right here, right now, okay? Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. Uh. Uh. Well, I'm ser I'm serious when I say this. Like, it is incredible to me how not enough people have heard this song. I'm almost upset about it. Because honestly, this, I mean, he's really. This is some flow that you hear from a professional rapper. Like I said before, like no one can question that Shaq is not the most talented NBA star. Yeah, I would I would just love to see another NBA star come out and try to make music as good as Shaq. I don't think it's possible. I've never heard it. I don't know of any other NBA star that raps, um, but if they do, they need to hurry up and do something because Shaq is coming back for his record. Shaq is coming for a Grammy and these NBA stars better watch out. So I'm happy that I could share this with you all. Um, I love Shaquille O'Neal, love his music. Anyway, like, subscribe, share. Goodbye.